Hello friends, welcome back to a new video that is MCQs on microbial culture media and this is the part 7 of the series of videos on microbial culture media and the first question of this video that is question number 116 that is halobacterium and sulfolobus can be cultured in presence of streptomycin because option A they are producers of streptomycin option B they lack target site for streptomycin action option C genetic drift will help to survive them or option D their ribosomes prevent any action or adverse effect of streptomycin so the right answer is option B that is they lack the target site for streptomycin action that's why they can grow in presence of streptomycin okay so let's move on to question number 117 that is changes in pH of the medium can be overcome by adulteration of media with option A buffer option B neutral rate option C NaCl option D bile salts and the right answer is option A that is buffers so changes in pH of the media can be overcome by adulteration of media with buffers okay so let's move on to question number 118 so after media preparation and streaking with culture incubation is done above 37 degrees celsius the resulting pure colony will be option a mesophyll option b psychrophyll option c thermophile or option d facultative mesophyll so the right answer is option a that is mesophyll so after media preparation and streaking with culture incubation is done above 37 degrees celsius the resulting pure colony will be mesophile okay let's move on to question number 119 that is in colorimetric analysis of culture the growth is measured as option is cfu per ml option b pfu per ml option c optical density option d as per beers lambert law suggest so the right answer is option c that is optical density so in colorimetric analysis of culture the growth is measured as optical density that is od so let's move on to question number 120 an organism after cultivation repetition has shown that it grow best at high hydrogen ion concentration it is a alkalophile option b acidophile option c basophile or option d neutrophile so an organism after cultivation if it is best growing at high hydrogen ion concentration then it is called option b that is acidophile they are acidophilic they love acid uh, acidophilic condition that means high hydrogen and concentration so the next question is 121 it is which of the following is naturally more acidophilic in acidophilic culture option a viruses option b fungi and yeast option c all bacteria option d all protozoa and the right answer about the naturally more acidophilic culture is option b that is fungi and yeast next one is 122 that is of the following which one is extrinsic factor affecting microbial growth and the options are gas composition option b temperature of incubation option c humidity percentage or option d all of the above so the right answer is option d all of the above so all of this above <coughs> extrinsic factor affect the growth of microorganisms okay so let's move on to question number 123 that is the gap or lean period of time between inoculation and first multiplication is option a log phase option b stationary gap phase option c lag phase or option d onset of decline phase so the right one is option c that is lag phase so let's move on to question number 124 that is the normal flora present in our body based on mode of nutrition is option a autotropic option b photoautotrophs option c heterotrophs option c 
chemo autotroph and the right one is option c that is heterotrophs so the normal flora present in our body based on mode of nutrition is heterotrophs okay so let's move on to question number 125 that is after media preparation and streaking with culture incubation is done above 50 degrees celsius the resulting pure colony will be option a psychotroph option b thermoduric option c thermophile option d facultative mesophilic and the right answer is option c that is thermophile so thermophilic bacteria they love the temperature or high temperature they grow on high temperature okay so next is 126 it is after media preparation and streaking with culture incubation is done above zero degrees celsius the resulting pure colony will be option is psychotroph option b psychrophile option c thermophile option d facultative mesophile and the right one is option b that is psychrophile so incubation is done above zero degrees celsius or around zero degrees celsius is for the microorganisms which are known as psychrophile okay so the next one is 127 that is when glass words are placed in an electric oven set to operate at 160 degrees celsius to 170 degrees celsius the process of sterilization is called dry heat sterilization or option b moist heat sterilization option c wet heat sterilization or option d high heat sterilization and the right one is option a that is dry heat sterilization okay so the next one is 128 when medium is made from components that wouldn't tolerate 120 degrees celsius 21 degrees celsius then better such medium are sterilized by option a at 160 degrees celsius to 170 degrees celsius in autoclave option b by bacteriological filter option c at 160 degrees celsius to 170 degrees celsius in autoclaving or option d incineration so the right answer is option b that is by bacteriological filters so if a medium is made up of components that wouldn't tolerate 120 degrees celsius then better such media is can be sterilized by bacteriological filters okay next one is 129 that is amongst the following information select an unauthentic knowledge about culture media and the options are option is sugar media cannot be harmed by autoclaving option b autoclaving detrimental to nutrient broth but suitable for nutrient dagger option c maconkey's agar is not suitable for autoclaving but broth is suitable for autoclaving or option d all of all of the above are unauthentic fact so the right answer is option d this all of these above statements are unauthentic statement or unauthentic facts okay so the last question of this video that is which of the following will grow on chocolate agar and options are option a neisseria meningitis option b hemophilus influenzae option c listeria monocytogens or option d all of the above and the right answer is option d it is all of the above so which of the following will grow on chocolate agar that is neisseria meningitis hemophilus influenzae and listeria monocytogens that means all of the above so these are all questions or mcqs on microbial culture media okay so thank you for watching this video